I was on the Bob Horn show. It was called Bob Horn's Bandstand. He was a disc jockey on WFIL, very popular. But he, he, was, he was an older looking guy. He wasn't a kid like who later came along, Dick Clark. And I used to remember going on the show and uh, I'd see Dick Clark sitting in a little studio on the right, good looking, all American kid. I think his, his, his uh, he had a jewelry company was one of his sponsors. And I'd wave, you know. And then what happened, evidently, Bob Horn got some kind of a jackpot, got in trouble, and they suspended him. And they talk about destiny. There's a guy sitting right there. They put him on. He looked great on the screen. had a great voice. He was sharp. And, and then by the th when he got on, the thing goes coast to coast now, five days a week from Philadelphia to California. Now, when you go on that show, the exposure is tremendous. So that was very important for the artist to go on there. We never got paid. We always signed the release for that three or 400 bucks we were supposed to get. Never got it. But you, you, just to get on TV, you don't care about the 400 bucks. You know what I mean? You're being seen coast to coast. My godfather, who lived in San Francisco, saw me one day, was tickled to death.